Hello everybody, I'm Bagler Bagel Plays, and uh, today we're going to be taking a look at this uh, pretty neat looking alpha game here. Um, it's called Escape Sierra Leone. Um, and the idea here is you're trying to escape from Sierra Leone. Ah? Ah? Yeah, it's a... Uh... Oh, look at that, a footprints. That's neat. Um, <laughs> it's, it's basically like you're on this island, it's a survival game, and you're trying to, uh, trying to escape. And I believe right now there's two ways to escape, I'm not 100% sure, but uh, anyways, yeah, I thought it looked neat. I actually already played for probably about a few minutes, I don't know exactly how long, but a few minutes just to kind of figure out what it was and part of it was I just wanted to see if it was worth playing. But uh, look at this, oh, a little bit of lag, look at this, the leaves, oh, no, there we go, the leaves move as you walk into them. I thought that was really cool. It's only on those bushes, but it's... See, those ones don't do it. I still like that. <laughs> don't judge me, okay? <laughs> I, I like small things like that. Even if it doesn't work perfectly right now. It's at least... Uh, and So anyways, yeah, I sort of just ran around for a little bit just kind of to get a feel for the game. Um, leaves and move. Um, basically I just kind of ran up here, ran through a bunch of bushes, and I believe it was here. I could be going the wrong way. I think it was here, somewhere, behind all these bushes. There is a yeah, little, little cabin-y type thing here. I don't know what it is, a little hut, made out of scraps of crap, and a gas can, or diesel. Um, yeah, so, that's, uh, that's pretty much all that I did. Actually, no, that's not true, I, where was it? Climbed somewhere, and jumped off and died. So fall damage is a thing, just want to point that out, I wanted to see if that was a thing. So I climbed up, I don't even remember how I got up there. Anyways, I, I was up at the top one of those kinds of little things or somewhere. And I was like, hmm, I wonder. And I died. So it's a thing. But uh yeah. This game this is a very early, early build of the game. I believe there's actually some mod that this guy made before. Can't remember the name of it, but uh this sort of a similar idea. And I was making a standalone version on the Cry Engine, which is a uh, very good good engine and uh, I don't know it looks it's looking pretty good considering this is a really early version um, this is also free I should mention that so it's up here uh, free version of the game since it's so early in development um, I don't want to go up there uh, yeah, so it's it's free right now. You can go go play the little pre version thing. Put a link in the description. It's also on Kickstarter. Um, so if you if you look at it and you're like, hmm, that looks like a pretty neato game, then uh, then you can go support it on there. It was also I think greenlit as well. So there are other people who like it. I think there's a road right here. So let's, uh. Ooh, is that a car? And a dead person? Oh boy. Okay, so I think. I could be wrong. And if I am wrong, people are probably gonna yell at me. But I think. Well, in comment form. At least, maybe not actually yell at me, but they'll be yelling at their screens. Is it G? Okay, that doesn't seem to do anything. I don't know, on the website it said to put fuel in your car, press G. If you have a, if you have gas, that doesn't seem to be working. Either that, or it's just not doing anything. How do we get into F? Yeah. So, 
Um, G said G starts it, so I don't think that worked. Okay. Well, maybe this car doesn't work. It said G, I thought. Oh, out of fuel. I, I, but I tried to put fuel in it. Okay, let's try this again. Eh. Is it gonna let me fill it up now? Eh. I'm pressing G as hard as I can. Do I have to hold it? Is the car moving? I think the car's moving. <laughs> uh, <laughs> maybe it's not fully working yet. Can I can I start it now? Not so I feel. Well, okay. Maybe we'll find another car that works. Who's this guy? You got a little shadow on your face there. Oh, it's moving. Look at that. And there's a gun right here. I feel safe already. Oh yeah, there's there's also a, a day and night cycle. I haven't actually played long enough to know if it's in, although since the shadows are moving I'd assume it is. Ooh, what's that? Are there any guys up there? Um I don't think so. Let's try going over there. Um So according to the the website said before you go I believe that there are NPCs in this version. I know there will be later if there aren't now, but made it sound like there was on the uh... By F, there we go um, made it sound like there would be like people to fight and stuff because it said basically said like don't mess with them until you have a gun and uh... a base which uh... i believe that you need a bed for a base or to like save it there very good view up here I snipe anybody with my pistol? I don't think so. Um, so I don't know. I haven't, you know, once again, I haven't played this for very long, so I don't know much, much about it. But I did read the stuff on the website. This is really tall. Ooh, there's a tower over there. Uh oh. Might have to go. Hey, where to go? It's probably behind those trees, I guess. Oh yeah, there it is. Um. It's this. It's getting harder to survey the area with the rebel incursions. However, the other day I did spot what looked like a small cave in the cliff walls above the fishing village. Alright, so what was it? Cave? Cave in the cliff walls above the fishing village. Don't know where the fishing village is, but that's okay. What's that? Bandages. Oh, cool. My gun. Is that is that it? Why is it down there? Oh, okay. Apparently, my I can only carry so many things. Ooh, is that a bed? I think that's a bed. All right, cool. Can I carry that? Okay, it didn't make me drop my gun. That did. Okay, so maybe you can carry some stuff. Oh, I think it said like medication didn't take up space or something. I don't remember. Anyways, I suppose we should try and sleep. Oh, it's getting dark. Because uh, I think this should save the game here. Is that going to work? Well, it worked, I think. But now it's dark. We look at the pretty lights in the ocean. So, uh... Yeah, I don't really like it when it's dark. I feel like it makes it harder to watch. You know what I think I'm going to do? It's pretty dark right now. I think it should turn to daytime eventually. So I might cut it here and come back once, a day, once it's daytime. Actually, can I sleep again? I don't think so. Um, yeah, I'll do that because I don't want to... don't want to... Uh, To just have a bunch of really dark recording stuff. So I'll do that. See you guys in a second. Okay, so it's uh it's daytime now. I am injured and dehydrated now. Don't know how I got oh there's there's the cola. I couldn't find this before, so I was gonna just move on. Oh there's my gun. So let's see, can I drink this? 
Did that drink it? I don't think that drank it. Um, how do I drink this? Is it G? All that. I'm still dehydrated. I don't know how you drink this. I would assume that you can drink this. I can melee with it. But anyways, over the night, I uh, got thirsty. Can I pick that up, please? Did I drink it? Oh, I think I think I drank it. Cool. Okay, I think I, I think it worked. Okay. I hope. <laughs> Maybe not. I mean, it could have just my hunger or my thirst could have gone down. Honestly, I'm not really sure. Anyways, I don't know what happened there. I can't pick it up anymore, so I'm assuming I drank it. That. Okay, I think that might have helped my hunger. Okay, so I think you have to to. Uh, can I not pick that up? There we go. I think to use something you have to press G. Oh wait, I have another one of these? Can I eat it? I don't know. Whatever, not gonna worry about it. Um, yeah, it was a long night. The, uh, the day-night cycles are pretty long. I'm not exactly sure if the sun's... I think it's, it's coming up right now, it's not setting. I hope. <laughs> That'd be bad, because then we won't have that much time, but it's probably fine. Um, yeah, so I just kind of hung out. I, I was able to sleep a couple times. It seems like every little bit it lets you sleep and use up some of the time, but you still become more thirsty and hungry. By the way, this little menu I found, it's a H. It's how you, you do that. Shows you a bunch of stuff. So anyway, I thought that was cool. Wait a minute, could I have... I probably could use those bandages to heal myself. Oh well. Uh oh, little blood splatters. That's not good. <laughs> it probably wasn't a good idea to just go AFK for a while, but you know. It happens. So, um... Yeah, I'm getting like hurt now, I think there's little blood splatters in the corners of the screen. Um, I'll probably die pretty soon here though anyways, so. So I'm gonna hopefully, I saw some towers over here. I'm gonna try and break in. Maybe find some gas or something. 